My next guests are all about bringing joy to an often overlooked part of fashion, socks. Not overlooked by me, because I love socks. Not only do they make fun, colorful designs for kids and grown-ups, they have a whole line of socks just to support important charities. From Are You Kidding Socks, let's welcome 13-year-old Sebastian, the CEO, and 15-year-old Brandon, the Director of Sales. Give it up! All right, well, Sebastian, I'm going to start with you because this all started because you were obsessed with socks as a little kid, right? Yeah, when I was about five years old, I always had this obsession for cool, funky, and high socks. And when I was in preschool, I used to go around uh, all my classes and just do a sock mini fashion show. And when I entered kindergarten, uh, the we were only allowed to wear black and white socks, and that bummed me out. But that didn't stop me because after school, I would hide, you know, the cool socks in my bag and then put them on uh, when my mom picked me up. Oh my God! And my mom. I just had wait. I just had a visual of you just walking into kid or like in, into preschool, just being like, "Do you see these? Do you see these? Like just like <laughs> hiking up your pants." That's awesome. My kids love socks too. So keep going. Tell us more. And then my mom saw the passion that I had for socks and then she was like, hey, why don't you start your own sock company? And I ran to the table, got my crayons, papers, and anything to design socks with. And that's how we started our business. I love that. So Brandon, how did you get this off the ground? I came into the business, how I did that. Sebastian, you know, when he sold socks with my mom for the first time ever, you know, he was six years old. He was a bit shy. And he didn't really know how to talk to me all the time. So my mom, Knowing that I love to talk to people, called my dad, and, hey, why don't you send Brandon here? You know, he likes to talk to people. And that's exactly what I did. I talked to people, and I sold some socks. That's amazing. Well, I'm telling you, I'm here to say Sebastian has come out of the shyness. And I have to tell you, a couple members of my band, y'all, are wearing Are You Kidding Socks. Can you show those off? Oh. Those are Get so it. This is a nice, I like this, guys. Even they're still musical, even with. <laughs> Jesse, Jesse wasn't wearing a shoe she could show you. She's wearing boots, so she, she's, you can use them as hand mittens, too. It looks really good. Hey, they, smell, so they smell good. <laughs> <laughs> so can you tell us about those designs? I love how fun they are and how colorful they are. So most of them were the charity socks. You had the autism, the breast cancer, the JDRF, the Amigos for Kids, and all of those are, we designed the socks. And some of those, uh, some patients actually designed the sock for the charity. Oh. And they uh, designed the sock for them. And we made it, and and we, and we designed this, they designed the sock, I'm sorry. And we sold the socks, and then we, made over $300,000 in uh, charitable contributions. That's amazing. Look how young you are making those big waves. That's so cool. Um, and you, you'd both say that giving back is a huge part of what you do, right? That's important? Yes, because all of our charity socks, we donate to them because, you know, it makes us feel so good about ourselves. You know, we're helping those who are struggling way more than we are. And as I said, we donated over $300,000 in charitable for contributions. And we also uh, went to a shelter after my uh, Hurricane Irma hit Miami. Mm. We donated 5,000 pairs of socks to those in the shelters. We actually went to a shelter. And we donated over 5,000 pairs of socks to uh, Texas when Hurricane Harvey hit. And uh, we just recently donated another 5,000 pairs of socks to Texas because of the snowstorm. And you need something to protect your feet, and socks is the perfect thing. Absolutely. Yeah, we just love giving back to those who are in need. And because we also know that there's so many people out here suffering, especially now with COVID-19, all these things going around the world, that, you know, people are suffering. And it's not good, you know, just thinking about them. Like, it makes you feel like, wow, what can I be doing right now to help those? So that's exactly what we're doing. We're taking initiative, you know, putting our socks out there and trying our best to, you know, sell socks. Because the more we sell, the more we can donate and give back. So yeah. everyone, you know, just buy some socks, you know, they're nice, they're cool. You get socks, it's a win-win. You get to donate money to those who are in need and you get some nice socks. I, li I like that pitch, that was nice. Um, and you- No, they call me sales. You say it again, I c it cut off. They call me the director of sales for a reason. Ah! <laughs> love you. I am so glad I asked you to repeat that. I love you so much. Yep, I'm still here, just waiting for you to subscribe. If you don't, I'll be trapped in this box forever.